ஆரம்பிக்கலாம் now and in this uh, tools we are going to see the basics of pymol pymol is one of the best visualizer uh, let us now learn the basics of pymol with a short demonstration uh, the main objective of this presentation is to list the variety of molecule visualizers just we saw now and to label the important functions and illustrate the basic operations of pymol and to practice the key functions for becoming expert so an introduction pymol was developed by warren lyford delano in 2000 it was written in the programs such as c c++ and python initially it was free and now it is academically free that means uh, the industrial people can use the commercial version only in 2010 the one of the best software scrodinger uh, bought this and incorporated in their scrodinger package uh, so this is the default view of pymol uh, once you download and install this pymol so when we when we open this is the default view in that there are two important windows one is command window where we import the biomolecules and the second one is the display window the imported biomolecules will be displayed in the display window in the display window there are five sections in the right side they are actions show hide label color so in in the upcoming section we will see the details of the each and every sections the first one is the actions so through the action we can display the biomolecule in better way even in a single click we can change the whole view of the biomolecule uh in show uh, this will show change the appearance of the biomolecule and the next section is the height so we can hide the specific or unwanted uh, part of the biomolecule the fourth one is the label section so in this section we can label each and every biomolecule separately as per the residue chain segments even by the atom we can easily label the biomolecule and the last section is the color so using this section we can change the color of each and every biomolecule to differentiate to make a more uh, attractive one these are the basic sections of pymol and uh, so once we open the bio, uh, biomolecule through pymol so there is a default view which i shown the encircled one so from that one we can visualize the same protein or same biomolecule into different forms which i have shown in the modified view so these are the different way to visualize the same molecule same biomolecule in a proper way so we will go through a demonstration how to visualize a, a protein um, in a better way and that's all for the session one so in the next uh, part or in the next video so we will see the more advanced features of pymol thank you